you beautiful people out there it's me again so in today's video i'm going to show you guys how i am able to install goddess faux locks onto my hair having short hair so excuse the background i'm going to try my best to do this tutorial while watching my baby boy he's down here playing with his toys so mom life be like. um, so if you guys have been following me for a while you guys know that my hair is short I cut all my natural hair off um, back in December but I am growing my hair out which I'll do another video on so stay tuned for that but I want to protect the style and at first I was like how am I going to do it with short hair because I know with crochet you got to braid the hair and this and that so I'm just like girl how am I going to install these things on short hair so I just said you know what I'm make it do what it do and I'm gonna do what I can. So I'm gonna show you guys how I went from this to this. And it was not easy. Okay, it wasn't hard either. But you know, I made a way. I got to record because I started doing it in my bathroom. So I was like, oh my god, let me stop what I'm doing and go and record, you know, at least the last bit so people could see what I did. So what I did. First and foremost, of course, I wash my hair, deep condition, and all of that because I like to do that before I protect the style. I always wash, condition, and deep condition, and all moisturize my hair before I protect the style and just the way. So just so that way I can make sure my hair is good to go when I protect the style. And then, well, I know I'm going to have to break my hair down because my hair is really short, so I need something to help keep the braids down. So I went to Sally's and got me some braiding hair, so I just got a pack of connect Kanekula hair and I just braided it down so I know you guys can see. So I corn rolled my hair with the braiding hair and that is how I was able to crochet those in. So you guys can see the braid right there. Boom. Oh my gosh, I look like Cynthia from Rugrats throwing out with this hair. <laughs> so since I know that I'm going to want to have my hair up and everything, and I don't like sometimes how when you crochet braiding hair, how the front looks sometimes when you crochet in. So I wanted to, so I want to at least have some leave out, you know, just crochet in. So what I did is I did the um, rubber band method on the perimeter of my hair. So as you guys can see, I took one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and I have one, two, three, four. So I have four back here, eight up here, so that way I can put my hair in a ponytail and it won't look crazy, okay? So that is pretty much how I set the foundation for this style for short hair. I feel bad because I wish I would have thought about you know recording it but I just got started because I didn't know because at first like I said at first I didn't know how I was going to do it and I didn't want to embarrass myself and be like oh my god this looks a hot mess so I got it so next time I do do it once my hair you know my hair is still short next time I do it I'll make sure to record it I got you girl so don't know what the rubber band method is it's pretty much you put the rubber band on your hair and then you pretty much put the braid or the crochet faux lock whatever it is on it and we'll go into that what i'm going to do now is i'm going to finish crocheting the hair in so that way you guys can see how i you know have been doing it this whole time and then when we get to the perimeter we're going to do this together because i may do it wrong i don't know it's my first time doing the rubber band method i've never done it before so if i embarrass myself y'all don't judge me but we're going to do this together all right so i'm here for to do less um, so I ordered this hair last week. I've had it for over a week and I ordered it from Amazon. I can leave a link down below if you want this exact hair. And um, I wanted like the, you know, the goddess lock type because goddess locks, I did a tutorial on goddess locks like a couple years ago, well, like two years ago. And it takes a long time to do goddess locks. You hear me? Like you have to braid the hair with braiding hair. Then you have to twist the hair and then heat. It's just a lot. So I got this hair from Amazon. And it was the six pack, so it came in six packs. So far, I've used four packs, so I have two more packs of this left. So this is going on this side, and then the other pack is going to be for my perimeter. And then I'll have some extras left over. Yay! And I'll just put the extras in between. You so silly. I'll just put the extras in between. But yeah, so it came in six packs, so that's plenty. Unless you got a big old head, then I'm um, just kidding. You might need more, but um, I'm just kidding. But um, yeah, so this is how it looks, just like that. So it's fully wrapped and then it's curly at the end, which is so pretty. 
and now we're going to continue to install so if you guys haven't followed me for a while you guys know that I struggle with the crocheting pin so I just use a bobby pin to install it because I mean as long as you get it in between the braid then that's what matters in the end of the day Perfect. 